what's going on everybody we are doing a brand new unboxing today from urban industry if i remember right this is a company based in the united kingdom i've never bought from urban industry before my first time but uh shipping was pretty fast Shipping was kind of high, but it's international. It was like 25 in shipping for DHL Express. That's probably why it costs so much. But this shoe came out, I think, last weekend. I'm not sure when this video is going up. This shoe might have been out for several weeks when this video actually goes up because I'm backlogged right now on videos, unboxings, all kinds of... I've got a, on YouTube already uploaded a bunch of videos, just not published yet. So who knows when this one will be going up. But, let's get into this. Oh, this is like a, that's interesting. It's like a, a tear, a tearaway box thing. Kind of. Let's try the other side. There we go. Laugh away on that one if you want. Because I'd laugh at somebody else doing that. And that's an interesting shipping box. Never seen anything like that before. So here we go. We got the receipt. This pair I got, I think it was, it was, a, okay, this pair had a price glitch when it first went up. And let me think of the whole story. It released price glitch when it went up they had this priced at 159 and then with 25 in shipping and then they also had a promo code for 20% off that wasn't supposed to work but it worked and then with tax it all came together that this shoe I walked away at 179 on release day and I thought for sure they were going to cancel this. That was kind of nifty. They sent me a sticker on the inside of the box. That's kind of cool. So these are actually custom made boxes for their company. Thank you for your order, Urban Industry. Uh, let's see, put the sticker back in there. Now we can do it. Get out of here. But this shoe, on release day, I got for $179 when it retailed. Europeans don't have the price sticker on them. When this retailed at, what were these, $230? I got them shipped with the price glitch at $179. As you see this, the Air Foam Posit Pro. I'm not a huge fan of foam posits, never have been. I only have one pair in my collection right now. I did have more. I did have the whiteout pair. I had the uh, that gold looking pair and something else. Right now, the only one I've got is what they call the Yeezy Foam Posit Pro. That's all I got. But these were such a good price. And I wanted to see what these looked like in person because the pictures, they look freaking sweet. Boom. Everybody remember these came out last weekend? Man, these things look good in person. With that dark, rich blue color. Man, these things are kind of what I would refer to as a uh, fire even though I'm not a foam posit kind of guy as everybody knows the foam posits they're the foam posit one no swoosh foam posit pro has the swoosh some people are big into one and not the other I don't care but uh these things, this is a very deep, very rich color of blue. It's almost like the color of like a royal blue with like a drop of, of 
violet in it to give it this color, this sheen. And I love how the bottoms are also, it's a different color of blue, actually a little more purple. I love how they transition that and just made this thing blue and black. Some people are saying, man, they, they, they should have made the bottom of this shoe black or a different color. I don't agree with that. I think this shoe just looks sweet as hell transitioning to that blue. Now, I'm glad I picked these up and I got these things for a hell of a price on release day. Release day. Sometimes you got to go around and look out for some of these websites that have glitches because sometimes, I'd say a good chunk of the time, they cancel your order, but sometimes they ship them out. And I'm going to give you a closer look at these sweet ass things. enjoyed that close close up look view of these shoes the more I see these like the more I'm honestly am in love with this shoe and I am not a foam posit kind of guy but these that color is just so vibrant I haven't seen this this shade of blue on a shoe before it's just like a royal blue with like a drop of violet in like the mixing bucket of paint that, that they did. But this shoe is uh, going to be a staple in my collection now. Be a shoe I will never give up. But these should actually hit sales here eventually because I doubt these are sold out still because uh, foams have pretty much have died. They've dropped off to the land of nothingness. Those damn uh, Weathermans and the other one they had that was a stupid Safaris and those things just kill foam posits. It killed them. They need to actually put foam posits up on the shelf, I'd say for three to five years and then bring them back out with OG colorways to rebuild up hype. But they're only releasing them now, I bet you, maybe once every couple months, which is smart on their part because the market's dead. But shoes like this, with this kind of a colorway, is just sweet as hell. And they will come back over time. They just released one of these a few months ago in like a bright red, or like an all red kind of colorway. I don't really, I'm one of those few, I don't like most shoes that are all red. And of course, as I say this, <laughs> there's an all red shoe above my head. Only one I got in my collection that's all red, so at least I'm not totally lying. But as always, please subscribe to my channel. I'm giving away a bunch of cool stuff at a thousand subscribers. I'm about 60 away now. I'm giving away a pair of Jordan 11 Concords. I'm giving away gift cards to shoe stores, maybe gift cards to Best Buy, other kinds of electronics. I'm going to be giving away a lot of really good stuff to you, my subscriber and subscribers, plural, because this is a multiple giveaway. I will drop a video when I hit my 1,000 subscribers, which might be within a matter of days and I will decide how I'm going to do it, when I'm going to do the drawing, but keep out a look or keep a lookout for that video. Give this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down, either way, I'm good. Thanks for watching and have a good one.